Oh, hello, welcome. Oh, shh. We have to be a little bit quiet today. I have a patient who's napping in the back. <laughs> yes, we, uh, we just completed quite an extensive energy regen, so they're just having a little rest, okay? <laughs> it's nothing to worry about. You're welcome to come in. How are you doing today? <laughs> it's so nice to see you. I feel like it's been ages. Oh. <laughs> well, yes, I, I suppose that is true. Adventuring does take up a lot of your time. <laughs> and a lot of your health, apparently. You look like you can barely stand. What's going on? <sighs> oh, no. Well, those are terrible for your energies. Come on, come in, come in, come in. Have a seat, please. Let's take a look at you now. Um, if you could take off your armor, please. Yes, uh, here, you can set it right over here. Yes, thank you so much. It's just a little bit hard to get to you with all of that metal. <laughs> Great, okay. Alright, let's see here. Uh, close your eyes, please. Hmm, let's see what's going on here. Hmm. Yes, it looks like you have quite a block. Oh. Oh dear. Yes, I see it here. It's all very muddy up here in your head. Oh. No, no, no. You're, you're, you're quite clean. Um, I don't mean it literally. It's, um, it's like your aura has, um, just a very dark and cloudy feeling to it. And, hmm. Hmm. It's, oh, it's, it's very sharp. It tastes like copper and sulfur. Oh, well, that's no good at all. Oh, have you fought a demon recently? Oh, oh, were you traveling with a cleric at the time? Oh dear, well, that's no good at all. Uh, just a moment while I find something here. Don't worry, it's no trouble at all. I can definitely fix you right up. But, just so you know, in the future, if you are going to be contacting or fighting demons or spirits from the Dark Realm, you certainly should be traveling with a cleric for your own good. Uh, let's see. What have you been experiencing recently as far as side effects? Um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Have you been having any headaches? Mm -hmm. And where are your headaches? I see. Yes, that's common. Um, any dizziness? Okay. Alright, no, no, I'm listening. I'm just looking for something important here. I want to make sure I get everything right for your particular instance here. Um, hmm. I'm going to have some dill. Mm -hmm. Just write this down real quick. Okay. Okay. And some clove. A um, mm, little bit of ginger. Some sage. Certainly. Um, okay. All right. A little bit of mint and uh, verbena for clarity. Mm hmm. No, oh, no. You'll be totally okay. Don't you worry. Uh, you did defeat the demon, though, right? Mm -hmm. And did you do a cleansing afterwards? Oh, thank goodness. Uh, when's the last time you bathed? Okay, and that was after the fight? Just just a regular bath and nothing nothing particularly um, fancy. Uh, you haven't bathed since then. Okay, um, I am going to have you bathe here. Um, you would be surprised at the cleansing power of just plain clean water. Um, however, I am going to make a bath for you. Um, that will help you a little bit since it's been a couple of days since um, you had this encounter. Um, and unfortunately, there is some energy left on you that has been festering. Um, and I think um, you'll do really well with, with a, a little quartz soak um, with some herbs in it. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think that'll be really nice. Mm-hmm. Um, let's see here. Mm-hmm, yeah. We're gonna wash all of that off of you, don't you worry. And then we're gonna do a little bit of energy work. Yeah, no, it'll be very relaxing. <laughs> you should know by now, when's the last time I hurt you, hmm? <laughs> Only for your own good, right? <laughs> And next time, you'll know, come in a little sooner, okay? <laughs> Don't be embarrassed. Hey, look, you may be a professional, right? <laughs> this may be your profession, but it doesn't mean you're perfect. Nobody is perfect, you know? I'm not even perfect, goodness. <laughs> We all have things that we have to learn, and it takes a long time. <laughs> Everybody has a lifetime of experience, but some people's lives are a little bit further along, right? <laughs> Making a mistake isn't embarrassing at all. It's just adding something to your repertoire. <laughs> a little piece of knowledge to take in for next time, right? Now, let me get back to this here. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, 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 dear. Okay. I'll have to create a poultice for your forehead. Mm-hmm. Mm, mm hmm We're going to have, um, some rosemary, some eucalyptus, some myrrh, sandalwood. Um, and that should really help you. I'll put it on you before you get in the bath, and I think it'll feel really nice. <laughs> I'll also make you a nice tea to have. Maybe some chamomile and lavender, a little bit of lemon. <laughs> I think you'll feel much better after the bath. Mm. Okay, let's see here. And mm, no, not this. Okay, here we go. Let's see. We'll need some uh, some Himalayan salt, some baking soda. Um, Mm -hmm. Crystal and uh, herbs here. Okay. Hmm. No, you don't need a milk bath. You don't. You don't have any lesions, do you? Nothing on the skin. Okay. Just been feeling very tired. Mm hmm. Yeah. Well, that's because you have something leeching your energy. It's almost like a spiritual parasite. Yeah, that is what it'll do to you, unfortunately. It is very draining, but it's also very easy to get rid of if you know that it's there and you know how to get rid of it, which, you're in luck, I know. <laughs> Don't even worry about it. Um, let's see here. Um, I'm also going to add some lavender and a little bit of orange zest to your bath, just to help you just kind of wake up a little. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. I think... Yes, very good. Okay. All right, I have it all written down here. I'm going to gather all of the ingredients, get your bath set up, make you a cup of tea. That way you can have something to drink while I'm getting everything set. And you just sit tight and do your best to relax, okay? All right. Don't worry. I'm going to take really good care of you. It's going to be okay. <laughs> Here. I'm going to give you this blanket. Uh, there you go. Wrap you up all nice and tight. And you just sit right there. I'll be right back, okay? I'm just going right over here to the counter. All right. <sighs> Let's see here. Go ahead and get 
boiling and I will get this tea together and we will fix them right up. All right, I need, let's see, one teaspoon of this one and a teaspoon of this. Okay, and where is, uh, yes, this one, okay. And just a tiny little sprinkle of this in the tea bag. Um, hmm, let's do this one, okay, just a little bit or else it'll taste terrible. Right, put that one. Okay, where's, oh, perfect, mm-hmm, some of this, and, um, oh, you know what, I have it fresh over in the windowsill, let's see, um, here we go, about that much should do it. Thank you, little plant, you're doing great. Mmm, I love the smell of fresh cut herbs. Ah, oh, it's so nice. <laughs> it releases such a calming energy into the air. Mmm. <laughs> Alright, that's all set. Um, let's get you... Hmm. Let's do the cat mug. Oh, that'll be really nice. <laughs> and it feels really nice in the hands, too. Plus, it's really cute. Bag set in there. We just have to wait for the water to boil. All right, the water is just going on its way. <laughs> as soon as it's done boiling, I will go ahead and get your tea while I set up your bath. But while we have a moment here, I just want to ask you a couple of questions to make sure that you don't need to have like a follow up with somebody else or maybe a referral to a specialist or something. Well, you see, when you're dealing with um underworld spirits um unfortunately sometimes you can bring things home with you and in some circumstances you can bring things home with you without knowing uh, especially if you're more of um of a uh, physical alignment <laughs> such as yourself um so i just wanted to ask you a few things okay okay um how have you been sleeping Mm-hmm. Okay. Nightmares? Hmm. Can you tell me what kind of nightmares you're having? Do you see any... any specific thing or person or imagery? I see. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Well, um, how about when you're away? When you're alone, um, typically in the dark, but it can happen when the lights are on or when the sun is up. Um, have you heard any strange sounds? Like a voice or, um, breathing or, um, have you had anything fall or move in your home? Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. That's alright. It's okay. Have you had any issues with, um, seeing figures? Maybe a darkness out of the corner of your eye, or if you're lying in bed at night, you think you see someone standing in the corner. Have you experienced any of that? Mm, I see. Yes. Okay. Well, that's alright. Um, can I ask exactly, what is the level of, of the spirit that you fought? I see. Okay. <laughs> Don't be embarrassed. It's okay. I'm not going to shame you. I will, however, say you must be careful. Okay? Please promise me you'll never try to do something like this again without a cleric. <laughs> Please. Promise. Thank you. I will feel much better knowing that. <laughs> Now, um, I'm going to write you a referral to one of my friends. They're an excellent healer and cleric, okay? They're going to come to your home and they're going to cleanse your space for you, okay? Now, of course, there is a small fee for that, especially since it has to be a home visit. Um, however, I assume that fighting something that high level, you are compensated. 
appropriately. Fantastic. Okay, good. <laughs> Thank goodness. Well, you know, in the future, if you do decide to bring a cleric into your party, you may perhaps end up paying a little bit less just by, you know, splitting the party fee rather than having to hire someone after the fact. Um, so, you know, it can help you a little bit there, too, and be a little bit of an incentive. <laughs> all right. No, it's, it's no problem at all. I'm sure they'll be happy to help you. <laughs> it's very common, especially for... <laughs> slightly newer adventurers. <laughs> all right, I think your water is about ready, so let me go get your tea for you, okay? go. Just let it steep for about five minutes, okay? I'm gonna go and get your bath ready, and as soon as you're finished with your bath, you'll have a nap here, and then you should be good to go, okay? Oh, um, don't, don't go home until you are able to get it cleansed, because unfortunately, you may experience the same troubles that you came in here for. Mm, yes, it could come back. Well, you should be able to get it done today, I think. It's quite a fast process, and they only live just in town, but if you have any trouble, you're welcome to stay here, okay? <laughs> of course you can stay the night. That's what my beds are for. <laughs> no problem at all, okay? All right, now, you're all set. I'm gonna go get your baths ready, all right? Just relax. I'm really glad you came to see me. <sighs> I've missed your face. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 